No, grooming happens countrywide. I think Rotherham's issue is particular because it seems to be focused entirely around sexual grooming. Here in London, our grooming tends to be along the lines of county lines, which is more based on drug distribution. But of course, these type of crimes very quickly become about sexual exploitation as well, both to recruit and control the young people, but also to make profits as they spread their tendrils out across the country. And how are they managing to, do you know how they're managing to target and trap um, girls and boys into essentially becoming slaves to their gangs? Look, uh, county line, sexual exploitation isn't new. When I was young, we used to call it going country. The difference now is that the gangs are much more um, organised and they're much more deliberate about it. And there's certain members of each gang whose sole job it is to go out and look for young, vulnerable people. And it's a combination of friendship and bullying and some very dirty tactics around robbing a young person once they've given them drugs, making them feel like they've rescued them from someone who is sexually exploiting them to then go on and do even more. Those sort of tactics to bring a young person into their confidence. But I would say to any young person, the first step in, in removing yourself from this situation is to tell a, a responsible adult around you. Because the key thing about grooming children is isolating them from the adults in their life.